a.m. So this is uh, southbound on Highway 17 right at the summit. Last time we talked, the right lane was blocked by a car that flipped over, and it looks like they've managed to pull this off to the right shoulder. So the, uh, the bit of a backup that we were talking about last time coming out from Redwood Estates has dissipated. So that's better news. One thing, the Silicon Valley actually has had a pretty easy morning of it as far as stalls and crashes. And uh, the traffic at this hour has really thinned out. So we're looking nice on 280, 85, even 101 is looking great from South San Jose all the way into Santa Clara. Where we're still a little hung up, southbound 880, getting through Fremont, we see uh, brake lights from Dakota Road down to about Stevenson. Then you pick up the pace. 24, we've been paying for this in time since the get-go. So westbound 24 slows out of the Walnut Creek Interchange coming off of South 680, most of the way out to the Orinda Crossroads. Once you get around Camino Pablo, that's where things picked up. We had a long-standing accident early this morning at Wilder Road. Your next update's at 948 on the traffic leader, KCBS. Expect some showers throughout the late morning into the afternoon today. Highs getting into the 50s and 60s. Tonight, chance of showers with lows in the 40s and a lingering slight chance of showers expected tomorrow. Traffic and weather together on the 8th and on News 1069 and AM 740 KCBS. Doug Andrew here. Learn how to make money safely with little to no downside risk. Join us for one of five Retire by Design workshops. We're coming to teach these free workshops in Morgan Hill, Palo Alto, Dublin, Alamo, and Sacramento, Wednesday through Friday, November 9th through 11th. Call now to register and get details. 1-888-261-8181. 1-888-261-8181. That's 1-888-261-8181. Abortion to inflation, the issues in our local elections have far-reaching implications. We're breaking these issues down on the home stretch, Odyssey's new original podcast. I'm Doug Sovereign. Each week I'll talk to a range of experts to give you a no-fuss 15-minute download of the most pressing issues on this year's ballots. Listen to the home stretch on the Odyssey app or wherever you get your podcast. At Prime Mail Medical, they understand how frustrating it can be to experience difficulties in your intimate life. Their mission is to provide you the medical care you need for improved performance. At Prime Mail Medical, we have virtually every medication known to man to help men. We specialize in treatments for ED and low T, and we have a 99% success rate. Most impotence problems can be treated in just one visit. That's Dr. Robert Rowley from Prime Mail Medical. We offer a variety of treatments including high-dose sublingual lozenges, ultrasound-based shockwave therapy, and injectable therapy. We can also treat testosterone issues when needed. Prime Mail Medical in the East Bay and San Francisco. Get your customized evaluation for just $99, which covers a full year of free visits, including a PSA test, testosterone test, and ultrasound. Call now, 415-761-4037, or go to primemailmedical.com. That's 415-761-4037. KTBS News Time 942. Like many cities, San Jose is facing an ongoing shortage of police officers. And KTBS's Margie Schaefer reports police staffing also has become a central issue in that city's upcoming mayoral race. It's been well documented that San Jose has a thinly staffed police department, and Sergeant Christian Camarillo explains the national average for a thousand citizens is 2.4 police officers. In San Jose, it's one police officer for every thousand citizens. If you use that national average number, we should have 2,400 police officers. Uh, right now, we are budgeted for 1,173. Currently, there are 952 street-ready officers. Sergeant Cat Alvarez, a field trainer, is calling for an end to relying on a smaller number of officers to work more. When people are overly fatigued, they make mistakes. Their reflexes are slow, their critical thinking skills are diminished, and their temperament is tired. And she says the impact on new officers is exponentially larger without experience to fall back on. San Jose City Council recently approved a lateral hiring bonus pilot program of $10,000 for officers who come from another police department. In San Jose, Marky Schaefer, KCBS. A surfer got a little too close for comfort to a shark in the water near Pacific Grove in Monterey County yesterday. Happened just after 5.15 in the afternoon when the shark bumped the surfer's board, throwing them off of it. The shark was about 100 yards off the shore of Otter Point. Police say the surfer paddled to the shore and wasn't hurt. Now, the board is being tested to potentially determine the shark species. The coast will stay open, but signs about the encounter are being posted in the area. 
KCBS News Time 943. The NFL tra uh, trade deadline is approaching. We'll get an update in sports in just over a minute. The following is a paid commercial announcement. Were you abused by a priest or clergy member? You are not alone, and we can help you hold the church accountable, regardless of your age, and even if your abuser is no longer working or even living. Thousands of victims have filed claims and been awarded significant compensation, but the deadline is quickly approaching, so call Stop Clergy Abuse right now. Your call is free, private, and confidential. Even if you don't remember the abuser's name, we may be able to help, but time is limited, so call now. Catholic Diocese have paid more than $3 billion to victims, with the average national settlement at $268,000. In parts of California, the settlements are much higher. Call 855-43-ABUSE now, or soon you may forever lose your chance to file a claim. You can't change the past, but you can be compensated for it. Call 855-43-ABUSE. A representative is standing by to help. Call 855-43-ABUSE. That's 855-43-ABUSE. Pizza party, anyone? Invite your friends and slice up the savings at Whole Foods Market. Frozen pizza is 35% off through November 1st, while supplies last. Prime members save an extra 10%. Shop in-store or online. Terms apply. Coming up on KCBS. I'm Jim Taylor. It is no wonder teachers are leaving the teaching profession. We need to pay our teachers more. CBS News Time 945. Let's head over to the Bay Area Chevy Dealer Sports Desk now to talk some football with Stephen Langford. It is trade deadline day in the NFL, and the first big deal has been agreed upon as the Detroit Lions are trading star tight end TJ Hawkinson to the Minnesota Vikings. In exchange, the Lions receive a second round pick in 2023 and a third round pick in 2024, along with multiple fourth round picks. The Vikings are 6-1 and one on the season, and an already potent offense just grew stronger with the addition of Hawkinson. They are currently first place in the NFC North. It is all quiet for the 49ers as of right now, but the big trade for the Red and Gold took place two weeks ago with the, with the acquisition of Christian McCaffrey. Teams have reportedly called about potential offers for running back Jeff Wilson Jr., but head coach Kyle Shanahan says he doesn't foresee a change in the roster. I think we're pretty set, but um, I mean, we listen to a call on anybody. I mean, we're never not going to listen to people, but I'd be surprised if anything goes down, but... You know, until the deadline, we're always listening. That was Shanahan speaking to reporters via conference call. The deadline to make trains, trades is at 1 p.m. Pacific, so we'll keep you updated on any transactions right here on KCBS. As for the Golden State Warriors, they picked up the fourth-year option on James Wiseman's rookie deal for a value of $12.1 million. Wiseman first signed the contract back in 2020. The team also picked up the third-year options of Moses Moody and Jonathan Kaminga. Both players just turned 20 years old. We get to see that development of that's that younger sad. players at that's least until work. next season. Oh they also signed Jordan Poole really and like Andrew that. Wiggins to contract ex extensions before this year. God. Golden State continues their road trip this afternoon in Miami. At the Sports Desk, Stephen Langford, KCBS. Thank you, Stephen. The KCBS Sports Desk is sponsored by the Bay Area Chevy dealers. Visit Bay Area Chevrolet dealers. A global pandemic, social unrest, and wild market swings. Welcome to the new normal. For investors looking for financial stability, it's a challenge. But now there's Reliant Capital. Reliant could give you high returns with no market risk of any kind, 10 to 12 percent, and it's eligible for an IRA or 401k rollover. Call 800-788-1000 and get the kind of returns Warren Buffett's been earning for years. Invest in something you can rely on. Call 800-788-1000 for your free brochure. What's an investor to do these days? With a worldwide pandemic and economically turbulent times, you wonder, where can I find a reliable investment? Answer, Reliant Capital. Reliant could give you high returns with no market risk of any kind, 10 to 12%. And it's eligible for an IRA or 401k rollover. Call 800-788-1000 and get the double-digit returns Warren Buffett's been earning for years. Protect what you've worked for and call 800-788-1000 for your free brochure. Kansas City Steak Company, another AmericanEagle.com success story. Started in 1932 as a family-owned butcher shop, today they're a leading distributor of superior all-American steaks delivered right to your door, ready for the grill and your taste buds. When it came to their website, an average site wouldn't do. They chose AmericanEagle.com to take their website to the next level. With a dramatic increase in competition and a softening market demand, they had two challenges. Improve their brand presence.
improvements in message and produce a positive return. AmericanEagle.com got to work and executed usability studies and detailed audits of site experience, digital assets, and marketing. The results, an integrated digital marketing and customer experience plan, organic traffic increase of 20%, and a long-term